So the Rockets win the tip. And a look at the starters for the Cavaliers. Good news out there was Zadina Zilgowskis. Then it's Larry Hughes. And it's LeBron James. And it's no in at the one spot. It's up a three. Hands it from downtown. Larry Hughes. It's simple. If you get open, LeBron will find you. The king is an incredible passer. Pass to Scola. Houston moving it around. Wilkowskis against Austin. Here's McGrady. A three off the mark. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I was able to catch up with the head coach of the Rockets. He's looking for his guys to put up a terrific performance tonight, especially at the defensive end. He said, we want to use our length and athleticism to protect the rim, make it hard for shooters to get clean looks. This is the first meeting of the season between these two. Guys, we'll see how it comes out. David, thanks for that report. Focusing on the defensive end. Greg, we'll see if they can get the stops. Staying connected to shooters. I think if they can do that, they have a great chance to be successful. And that's going to take great communication out on the perimeter. Expect them to switch quite a bit. LeBron, that's a two-pointer. And the shot no good, a bit short. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on it. A shot by McGrady, no good. The Cavaliers on offense. And a wide-open look for James. And LeBron another three James. for Cleveland. The jumper of LeBron looking more and more pure. Bad news for the rest of the league. Here he goes. McGrady, the baseline jumper goes down. McGrady's got eight points. They're getting him shots in his spots. That's understanding your personnel. LeBron James on the wing. The 10-footer. Another miss by LeBron. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. And he comes up with the deuce. He's got 10. Riding the hot hand, and why not? If something's working, keep going to it. Pass to Snow. Back to James. Some solid defense from Battier. I mean, all period, it's been a struggle for him scoring the ball. Scola, there's just a McGrady. They get it again. Out to Battier. Pass to Alston. Hughes with the steal. Here's Snow. And the shot Eric goes down. Snow. Any chance you get, you want to put yourself Larry in a position Hughes. to succeed. And that's what he did there. Great job of reading the floor. Got to the rim and made a play. Now, here is Battier. Cranes it from beyond the arc. Adding to this lead, he's been dependable and consistent at the offensive end. James in the post. Battier on him. And James gets it to go. When he gets touches inside, LeBron is impossible to stop. Driving in. That's going to be out of bounds. The Rockets will retain possession. Jackson is checked in for the Rockets. Cleveland also making some changes. Anderson Verajaus checked in for Gooden. And Daniel Gibson subbed in for Snow. McGrady kicks to Alston. A three-pointer no good. You know, he might want to think about deferring for a while. He's had his chances this quarter, but just not able to convert. Here's Hughes. Yao with the block. And you have to appreciate the reach of me. Superb at putting himself in a good position there to block the shot. McGrady right side. Buries it from three-point range. McGrady's got 16. As hot as he's been this quarter, the game plan is simple, folks. Get him the ball and get out of the way. There's a minute 40 left to play in the first quarter. Inside. Yao with the block. Outside Jackson. It's back to Battier. Stolen by Verajan. LeBron against Battier. 
James steps LeBron back James. and dreams the jump shot. The and it's seven points for Daniel LeBron. Gibson. Nothing better than a hustle play like that. It gets the whole team amped up, sets the example for everyone. Austin, good. Yeah, and you got to respect the size McGrady has. Easily seen over the defense there to spot the open man. Hughes against Austin. Hughes with it. Not going to go that time. Some solid defense from Battier. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. They keep calling his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. Yao gets to Alston. Yao, the pass to Battier. Now Alston, defended by Gibson. They get the rebound out to Battier. They double him with LeBron. And some nice passing there by Houston. Jackson, that's good. That was a great pass once the double team came over. He hit the wide open man perfectly. LeBron against McGrady. James looking it over. Just three on the clock. And no good on the last second attempt this time. And so it's Houston holding on to an eight-point lead heading into the break. And their three-point shooting has paved the way for them. We've got more in store for you right after this. Just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown so far for the Rockets. They didn't need any time to warm up from long range today. Their three-point shooting has been terrific in the first half. Yeah, also, though, they've done a good job of counting the offensive glass for second chance points. The Cavaliers trail by eight. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Jones is out there with Daniel Gibson. Then there's Anderson Verja. Then there's Gooden. And it's Marshall in at the small forward position. Now here's Marshall. And it's off from three-point range. A good job by him on the glass here tonight. Plus eight in that department. And the basket by Scholar. Well, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball move. Here's the pass to Marshall. Gibson against Jackson. Jones from outside. Cleveland the rebound. Back to Gibson. Driving inside. And it's Daniel Gibson Gibson's. finishing it off. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Here is Ed. No points in the game yet for him. A little artistry in the painted area converting against the size. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Tumbo is checked in for Luis Scola. And a switch here also for Cleveland. Snow is checked in for Daniel Gibson. Quarter number two with just over a minute gone. Jackson against Snow. Going inside. Lock at six. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. And it's sent back by Matumbo. And the ferocity on display defensively here from Matumbo. Just an incredible shot block. And we're now about a minute and a half into the second quarter. Takes it inside. Head kicks to Jackson. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Jackson's got the lead up to 14 now for Houston. And how about the last five made shots have all been three. The defense is just giving up a barrage. Here's Snow. Rebounded by Jackson. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Here is Ed. Back to Jackson. To the wing on the left. 
Novak inside. Good in defending. Just four to shoot. Here's Head. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And these are his second and third free throws tonight. Second team foul. The first free throw is good. At the line for your Rockets. Luther Head. Two shots. Good on both. And so it's Jones. He'll bring it up for Cleveland. It's a 16-point game. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Three-pointer, snow. Tumbo grabs the board. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. And he stays with it. Back to Jackson. Over snow. And Jackson gets it to go. Jackson's got his third basket of the night. Textbook. Nice pass. Great catch. Even better finish. Timeout, Cleveland. Timeout, timeout. All right, let's see something out of the court. Get loud for your club city Denver. Houston with a big group substitution here. Yao, he's checked in for Matumbo. Landry comes in for Steve Novak. Tracy McGrady's checked in for Ray for Alston. And Brooks subbed in for Jackson. And for those of you just joining us in the second quarter with about three minutes gone by. No against Brooks. Out to the right wing. And Gooden kicks to Marsh. It's stolen by McGrady. Brooks, the pass to Yao. No one near Landry as he lets it go. Off target from three-point range. The Cavaliers trail by 18. Jones looking for an opening. McGrady against Snow. Over in the corner, Gooden. Six to shoot. To stop the run. Rebound by Yao. Yao's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's McGrady, and he dunks it down. And McGrady has an impressive vertical there, showing once again with how well he dunks the basketball. And it's the Cavaliers with the ball. Here's Snow. Two Jones, the best of Here's minutes. Snow. Back to Verizhao. Pass to Snow. There's the three. Landry grabs the miss. And they just can't find a way to end this thing. Nothing falling right now. All you see is a lot of frustration. Someone needs to step up and make a play to turn this thing around. It's stolen by Jones. Now here's Marshall. McGrady covering. 124 left to play here in the half. Outside, Jones to the paint. Here's Snow. Picked away. And there's Tracy McGrady, the assist by Landry. McGrady's got four this quarter. Yeah, you got to love seeing McGrady when he's hot. An amazing score from any spot on the floor. Timeout, Timeout called Timeout. Cleveland. Nice game. Great performance by Tracy McGrady. Just killing it for him. They, they've got to be all up in his jersey at all times. Give him even an inch, and you just ask it for him to drop another triple on you. Houston making some changes. Tumbo is checked in for Yao. Mattier comes in for McGrady, and it's Jackson in for Luther Head. 
A big group substitution here for Cleveland. Ilgauskas is checked in for Verja. LeBron comes in for Marshall. Larry Hughes is checked in for Jones. And Daniel Gibson subbed in for Snow. James LeBron with the bucket. James. Great touch from the mid-range. LeBron looks to shoot from there very often. Outside for Jackson. Houston moving the ball around. And there's the drive. Here's Landry. Offline with his three. The Cavaliers trail by 20. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Here's Gibson. Solid shot from the distance Daniel of about 14 Gibson. feet. Gibson's got his second bucket of the game to go. Easy look for mid-range. He won't miss many of those lazy effort defensively. It's kind of hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many good looks from in quote. James, the pass to Hughes. Back to James. Pulls up on the wing. And Cleveland again LeBron with the bucket. James. Guys, that's just really unstoppable. He poses a ton of matchup problems for whomever he's facing. And so it's Houston with an 18-point lead as the quarter comes to a close. Their defense has been active and effective. Right back after this break. game from Tracy McGrady yeah, and the bulk of his damage so far has come from the perimeter a lot of threes early on he's been vital to spacing the floor for them makes everything else you want to do easier to accomplish our second half of basketball and presented by Gatorade let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third so on the floor for Houston we've got Matumbo Steve Novak is out there with Tracy McGrady and there's Jackson, and it's Francis in at the one. And it's the versatility. No matter what LeBron concentrates on, it's possible he can lead the lead in that. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. This is his first free throw of the game. Free throw good, McGrady. for Houston. Tracy McGrady taking two shots. And McGrady drops them both. Here's Snow. He takes it in, and he converts the layer. Snow. Here's Francis. Outside Jackson. It's rebounded by Zadrunas Ogowskis. The Cavaliers trail by 16 to the middle. Here's Hughes. And the layup's good off the glass. Hughes. Hughes got five now. Terrific play call to give him a clean look at the rim. That's how you want to start the second half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. So it's the Cavaliers now following McCready's three-point attempt. Pass to LeBron. Fades away. Rebounded by Jackson. And I was sure that was money on that one, but everyone is afforded an easy miss or two. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. And he makes that one. Like the size McGrady has inside. Fantastic at kind of angling his body there for the interior shot. James, the pass to Hughes. Shot from the wing, and James gets it to go on the assist by Hughes. Larry Hughes got four assists now tonight. Rockets call timeout. All right, Rockets coming out of the court. Anderson Verajau's checked in for Cleveland. 
Houston leading by 11. And here's Alston. Out of bounds, Cleveland takes possession. No clue <laughs> where that pass was going. That is a brutal turnover. The Cavaliers trail by 11. Passes it to Snow, and here is Hughes. He's covered by Alston. And it's great for Alston with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. On defense, the Rockets. 22 is their biggest lead. And the pass to Snow. Down to five on the shot clock. Now LeBron. Another three for LeBron Cleveland. James. Oh, great ball movement there. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. On the wing, Jackson. He's covered by Snow. Traps in the tray. Well, Grady's got seven now in this quarter. Yeah, and when you're hit, you gotta hit back. And you know he was going to try to respond. Those threes canceled each other out perfectly. Snow against Jackson. Here's James and the Cavaliers LeBron getting another James. bucket right there. Always fun to watch James go off like this. He's getting everything he wants on the offensive end. McGrady dishes to Scola. McGrady kicks to Jackson. Here's Alston. That's good. And it's Jackson with the assist that time. Alston's got his second bucket of the night. LeBron against McGrady. James, the pass to Verajan. Back to LeBron. Ilgowskis trying to get open. James, no good. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clear. The Rockets have been on target from the free throw line. They're 5 of 5 in that department. Free throw good, McGrady. And Cleveland making a change here. Gibson's checked in. The line for two. Grady drops them both. Impeccable from the line since halftime. And here's Gibson. He'll bring it up for the Cavaliers. They trail by 14. LeBron, and that one's good by LeBron. And no matter what they've tried, the D just has Two not been able to deny them. Inside. And no doubt about it, in order for them to be successful, he has got to be a catalyst when it comes to scoring. And here are the Cavaliers. Hughes. Eight points for him. Count it. Larry Hughes got Hughes. ten points in the game. And, and they've worked the ball around so well tonight for those quality looks from mid-round. Into the lane. Oh. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Oh, they're going for the throat. Here's Hughes. James in the post. McGrady covering. That one's not going to go. Houston moving it around. Scola dishes to McGrady. Knocked loose and stolen by Ogowskis. Here's Gibson. Good on the shot. Gibson's got his third basket of the night right there. He is really shouldering the load on the offensive end and doing an outstanding job. But he needs the rest of his team to step up. Here's McGrady, and Houston again with the bucket. These are big buckets. He's been instrumental in helping them try to close out this game. And he drives in, and the basket is good. Larry Hughes. Hughes got nine points now in the quarter. Wow, has he flipped the switch at halftime. Much more effective here in the second half. Here's McGrady. Here's the killer two-handed slam. Straight power, homie. I mean, he ripped it down. <laughs> with both hands. Absolutely a resounding dunk. Hughes, the pass to LeBron. 
fader on the way. Misses off the left iron. And physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. A plus 10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. Well, you know, they're in the lead, but he's still been frustrated from an offensive standpoint. Pass to Hughes. And Scola with the block. And he gets it back. There's the steal. And so it's Houston sitting with a comfortable lead up by 14. What a night they've had in terms of their shooting. Everything dropping in for them. And we'll be right back after this. And let's take this opportunity now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them. And what a beautiful feat. Fundamental basketball. Keep your eyes up. Keep the ball moving. You're going to keep the defense on its heels. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today. As we get going in quarter number four. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Lugoskis is out there with Gooden. Then it's Daniel Gibson. And it's LeBron James. And it's Hughes in at the two. And here is LeBron. Shane Battier getting his three to go. Hughes with it. He's picked up by Landon. And it's Gooden with the jam. And he can time his passes so perfectly. Wow, what an assist. Brooks kicks to Battier. And three passes to Alston. Dishes to Yao. Back to Alston for three. And James pulls it down. So frustrating when you can't get anything to go down as you're trying to help your team finish the job. No good that time. Good work defensively by Yao. Pass to Alston. And stolen by Ogowskis. Now Cleveland moving it up. Gibson leading the charge. Brooks outside. Takes it from 10. And Alston with the basket on the assist by Brooks. And the Rockets lead by 17. And let's get your take, guys, on the hustle stats for the Rockets. They've been playing such pesky defense. It's been very impressive, especially all the turnovers they've caused. And also, I've been extremely impressed with their interior D. Their rim protection has been as good as it gets. The Cavaliers trail by 17. Here's Hughes. Sinks the triple. Larry he is starting to build up a little confidence. Hit just one three in the entire first half, but he has hit two more since then. Here's Alston. He feeds it to Brooks. Back to Alston. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Brooks. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Passes it to LeBron. Driving to the basket. Got a piece of it. Brooks with no one around. And he's good on the three ball. A late reaction defensively. He quickly takes advantage. Grows their lead. You can't afford to give him space. Those kinds of mistakes have been the story of this game. Larry Hughes, Hughes good. I don't know what coach told him at halftime, but he is shooting the lights out right now. Drives to the hoop. Andre passes to Yao. Right wing. Here's Alston. And another three for Houston. The defense is far too slow to close out on those three-point attempts. Brooks against Gibson. Here's LeBron. It's rebounded by Houston. Battier's got four rebounds now tonight. Here's Alston. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Right side Gibson. This one for three. Another three Daniel for Cleveland. Gibson. And now they're shooting it pretty well. That was not something you would have said in that first half. Your Clutch City Texas. 
And now, let's present our New Balance player of the game, Tracy McGrady. And Kevin, it's a no-brainer. He's controlled every aspect of this game, and it's just so fun to see a player perform at a level that's just higher than anyone else out on the floor. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. Rockets leading by 17. Unloads from nine. Kicks to Nova. McGrady against Hughes. It's Novak from outside. Another miss by Houston. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. And they get it back. Snow. Dikembe Mutombo pulls it in. It's a shot you would think he would make, but he just Two doesn't make minutes. it all the time. Leading in the game. Jackson passes Two to McGrady. Minutes. Here's Hughes. Another three for Larry Cleveland. Hughes. Yeah, Snow, terrific Three job points. there. Just kind of setting the pace. Exceptional at breaking down the defense with his passing. Pulls up. High post. Nice Jeez. jump shot. Good. They're in total Jeez. command of this game with time starting to run out. Reason why they've tightened up the vice grip a little more each time up the floor. We'll see if they can close this one out. The shot by Hughes, no good. I mean, you won't see this too often. Getting denied at the rim. He's likely to remember that one. Got a piece of it. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the Houston ball in ball. You love the pressure he's putting on them. Almost had that steal. Fantastic anticipation. He has active hands. Even though he doesn't come away with the turnover, he's disrupting their offensive flow. The pass to Snow. Let's a floater go to the left wing. Ilgowskis a screen on McGrady. Here's LeBron. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. The raw power of James excels at taking on physical defense and finishing. Here's McGrady. He can't get that one. Great D that time from James. Pass to Gooden. And it's Gooden with the jam. And you got to like that they found something positive here. First something foul. that maybe carry overs into the next game. They put together some great possessions here at the end. It's a shame they could have used this run much earlier. Cavaliers making a switch here. Anderson Barajow's checked in for Ogoski. Marshall comes in for James. Daniel Gibson's checked in for Larry Hughes. And Jones subbed in for Snow. The Rockets making a switch here. Yao's checked back in. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. And that's the right approach for Gooden. A solid rebounder and an above average interior score. Down low. The basket by head. And the Rockets lead by 13. That one's going to be the final dagger, and these guys can now celebrate. Daniel this has been flat-out a dominant performance. They earned this victory all the way. Seven-second difference, shot and game clock. And that one's good. McGrady. McGrady's got 39. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. To the right side. Here's the three. And that one is off. 
So we see Houston taking the W here. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home tonight. And it makes a big difference. And once they started to really play in rhythm, it never felt like they had any doubts as to whether or not they were going to win. For Steve Smith, Craig Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. And we hope to see you again at the next event.